Remember me? Of course you do. I'm Rachel Hunter, and this is familiar territory for me. The Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Special. I appeared in my first SI issue in 1989, and then I made the cover in 1994. And I'm back, but I'm not alone. I'm at the beautiful Hotel Del Coronado, where Hollywood's great cross-dressing comedy, Some Like It Hot, was filmed. But I promise you, our girls look better in a swimsuit than Jack Lemmon did. This year, Sports Illustrated chose eight spectacular locations from around the globe, from Caribbean islands to the African plains, to exotic countries half a world away. Over the years, I've helped Sports Illustrated put a lot of places on the map, but this is the first time anyone has ever put a map on me. So take a look. This year is going all around the world. How can we really make something special to define what we're doing? We did bring back the ever-popular body painting and brought back the ever-popular Rachel Hunter. And we had Joanne Gare, our body painter, paint a bathing suit that we've had made out of a map on Rachel Hunter's body. I will make my geography by the end of this. Should we go paint? We know what's going I have never done body painting before. Um, oh. I've seen it and I have completely appreciated by looking at it what the work's gone into it, but I, no, I have never done it before. Actually, that's okay, that's... Rachel was fantastic. She looked better than ever. She was in amazing shape. Okay. You've got to be in an amazing shape to have a body paint. <laughs> There's nothing hiding that body. The USA. Ah. And let's do Europe next, because Europe looks really messy. Oh, Northern, Northern Canada's got a whole lot of little itty-bitties. You're on the map, Marilyn. Do you want Australia, New Zealand, or just New Zealand? I think you have Iceland in your, in your hands. I do? Okay, yeah. okay let's do the little island away. And yet, I feel completely clothed. From the guy's point of view, it's like it's like I'm dressed, right? Except 3D-ish. Whatever you say, right? Okay, I'm not convincing you guys, am I? The thing is, is that you completely see me here standing naked, don't you? Great! We have Canada, the United States, Mexico, Brazil goes down here, Alaska, Brazil again up here, Africa, Greenland, Iceland, Island. Then we have Europe over here. Middle East starts under there. Still trying to find Australia. Good, I like that. There'll be 14 rolls. Beautiful. Uh, pull back. Rachel Hunter has been one of the most beautiful, most classic, most requested models that Sports Illustrated has done. I'm so excited to be back on Spots on the Streets once again. I was really excited to get us back again. Being one of the old girls. <laughs> there you go, that's excellent. I'm not that old. Give me four variations. That's beautiful. People are going to love to see Rachel Hunter. That's it. Beautiful. Let's begin our world tour from a most misunderstood location. Our perception of Vietnam has been shaped by images from movies like Apocalypse Now and Platoon. But like most things that come out of Hollywood, the reality couldn't be more different. our first trip. It took a long time to get there, but it was worth it. It was a beautiful resort, the Anamandara. 
Lots of people, lots of fish, lots of boats, lots of action. Yeah, I've heard so much about Vietnam. I have a lot of friends that backpack through Vietnam, and um, they thought it was amazing. The locations that we've shot at, you're just never going to shoot at that type of location. <laughs> very rare that you go an hour up the river to a rice paddy in the middle of nowhere in Vietnam, you know? We're in some rice paddy, yeah? I'm gonna eat some rice. <laughs> what would a swim city should be without Walter Yost? He's an amazing pro veteran. We love him. Beautiful. Woo, nice. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. That was worth the river trip. It was so good. So we just had a little rain, but it's gone fortunately. So the the luck is with us. So now we're waiting for the sunrise. It's about 5:30 in the morning. And um, we're gonna rock and roll now. <laughs> there go. It's so nice and warm. Isn't it? It's nice to be in a location where it's not too cold of the air, of the ocean. I'm here in Vietnam. You always go to a beautiful place. It's the only planet that you bring me to a beautiful place like that. It's really nice, really nice. Wow. Gorgeous. Wow. Gorgeous. We're not in Kansas anymore, that's for sure, man. We're in South Central Vietnam, man. And this is the way they do things, man. We're going to stop traffic here, I tell you. And there's a lot of traffic right, to stop. Well. I'm just going to pretend it's Times Square. <laughs> Did I stop traffic? I don't think I stopped any traffic. I think they were just like, what is going on? And why is this person naked in the middle of our city? Some shot, huh? and um, if you need any fish, we have a lot of choice in here. <laughs> you see? They're on ice, they're putting the fishes on ice. We were under a bridge one morning with the ladies sorting through the fish and the children and sitting on the fish scales. Attach yourself to my leg. Everybody loves Peter. This is like the most exciting thing that's happened in the fishing village, I guess, ever. And it's hot. Look at that light. Look at this. Even the boats have closed in. Thank you. Oh, this 
jumping is not easy. It's pain all the time. So it's, I mean, it's, I'm not good at it. So I had to be rescued by the lifeguards. <laughs> Fortunately, they were around. But you should try it. It's really fun. It's amazing. We are in City Hall right now, at City Hall, and um, we're gonna do a shot with school girls. <laughs> they're right there. I think their outfits are pretty, aren't they? Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> Don't be scared, girls. <laughs> One of these girls doesn't belong here. One of these girls just doesn't belong. Oh, it's the one in the bikini. Thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. In Nha Trang, it's actually really interesting because when you go into the town, it's a real town. You know, people are like hustling and bustling and they're, they're just working. And then you just come on over to the ocean side and it's just complete luxury. When I'm in a group, I, I, I will be just one in the crowd. But then when you shoot, it's like you have to be the center of attention. You have to be. So I do turn it on and I work and then and I do work for the camera. It sounds silly, but you it really it does take something. You can't just sit there and take your photo. You have to really give it something. And it really comes across in the photo. Wanna put another shoot on her? We got that one. Four to two fiftieth. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Beautiful when you see them Beautiful. feel that light on your right eye. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Mm. I love that. Beautiful, Audrey. Yeah. Just relax. To be just be Audrey Fox, the most gorgeous girl in your Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> Well, when I'm lining up my models, I'm, I'm really thinking, obviously, models that have great, healthy, sexy bodies, I mean, that's very important, with great, sexy attitudes. So it's really a, a great range of beauties from everywhere. Supermodel Molly Sims probably has no trouble reeling in men. But when she tried casting a line in the streams of Colorado, she found her catch a little bit more elusive. Let's go fly fishing with Molly. My name is Molly Sims. We are in Meeker, Colorado at Seven Lakes Lodge. You can hike, you can bike, you can fly fish, which is my absolute favorite. I always get shoots that are um, kind of adventurous. Like last year, it was all about farm animals. This year, it's all about mud and fish and wilderness out in the open. Isn't it beautiful? Look. Colorado was the antithesis of Vietnam, where you saw lots of people in Vietnam, you saw lots of trees. Molly, great sport with the fishing. These are dock inspired right here. <laughs> your, Excuse me. Get The last shot we just did was um, a shirt that basically came to here that was kind of see-through and striped. That was pretty sexy. We did a little kind of doily, sexy bottom with a fisherman's vest. You always think when you go to somewhere like Sports Illustrated, it's going to be like beach and sun and beach. I never get beach. No, but I change. 
all in a day's work. I actually have to say I'm really enjoying my waiters. Ugh. They may look clunky, but let me tell you something. They are comfortable. Which one? Oh, God, this is not working out. Now you've got my ankle. Yeah, get your skinny leg out of this. They go through water. You're protected. And I like the high ones, too. That's kind of sexy. Nice. So it's illustrated somehow always gets you naked. <laughs> no, keep, it, keep it right to me like before. Let me, that's good. Robert Urban always does the most beautiful pictures. Naked plastic shape. Yeah. What's wrong with these people? Don't they want to know my intelligence? My brains? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, that's lovely right there. there that's nice. Look at that. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 oh, the things you have to do. <laughs> Look at me, I'm covered in mud. People get sun, people get beach, people get ex exotic tropical islands. I get meager Colorado with mud. How often stuff like that like this happen, Diane? Um, um, once in a lifetime, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> The shoot is good. It's kind of cool to have such sexy lingerie, like bathing suits on, and then paired with like a vest or waders. Like you have a little bit more action in the pictures. I like the background with the lakes and the river. It's not your typical beach and sand. I'm a fly fisherman. <laughs> This trip is great because it's in America, and I've always wanted to do an American trip. It's kind of nice to do something different, and I've never done it before, so. Why not? Keep going. This is called stripping. Tell them what you like. Telling supermodels to strip. <laughs> Mine's doing pretty well for a first timer. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I messed up. I'm obsessed with catching a fish. <laughs> there you go. Oh, you got him, you got him, go. No, I had him! Wait! God! <gasps> oh! Oh, shoot! God. <laughs> and I haven't got a fish at all. We'll catch up with Molly later and see if she's caught anything but a cold. But now, a private island, shark-infested waters, best friends in bikinis. No, I'm not trying to pitch a new reality show. It's a swimsuit fantasy in the Florida Keys. That's good, that's good, that's good. Chin up, chin up, chin up, little light, yes, beautiful. I'm Isabelle Fontana. That's it, there, there. Ooh, smiley, you have a beautiful place, open a half. I'm from Brazil. We're in a little Palm Island in the Keys. Optimal. Yeah, look at me, look at me again. It's beautiful. Let it go. Yes, there, like that. Good. Good. I love this place. It's just so pretty, so many trees. I love this, this feeling, you know. I'm very much into nature. <laughs> That's beautiful. Very nice. Brava. Look at me. Cool. Yes. Of, it looks like in the jungle, you know, like a lot of plants. It's really pretty, and I love that one. Lovely, 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 lovely. Yeah. The boat. Well, I, I drove the boat. But not too far. Oh, 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 oh. You know, I was really, really speeding. <laughs> I had fun. Yeah. This is my second year. 
and I'm really happy to be one of the girls they chose. Yeah. Nice, nice. Everybody's different, you know. And what we do, it's like we try to let them to talk about their own uh, beauty, their own sensuality, you know. We don't try to impose, so each one will react in his own way. Always in a camera, thing. Oh, she's having so much fun. <laughs> we're hoping it's going to be better, but it's very, you know, still very cloudy. We're hoping that the sun will come out so we can do better pictures. Nice, nice. The, the sun is going to come out because Anna just arrived, so she brought me the sun. <laughs> Hello, my name is Anna Beatrice. This is Hot, huh? Sexy. Young. Fabulous. Cool. First Illustrate is a big thing. It's the dream of every model. OK, do your worst. Excuse me. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. I know, you just got a great job. Good, good. Chill out, chill out. Yeah, beautiful. Right at Go on. More soft your hand over the breath. Soft, yeah. Lovely, lovely. Feel it. Oh, have so much fun. I love everybody, you know. This year, you know, it's been great. And the place is really nice as well, you know. Hot and beautiful, nice. Beautiful. Uh, every season, you know, it's amazing. And I love the way they've been cut, the, the different colors and everything. It's beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, 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 lovely. That's cute. Okay. <laughs> I think that's my favorite yeah. shot. Yeah. The photography is amazing, you know? Tiziano. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Look at me. Tiziano. The Italian. <laughs> Hello. Picture time. No, not me. We're almost, almost. He's a really nice guy, you know, really easy to work with. You know. You're amazing. Grazie. We we'll try to give a dream. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. Him. He's good. He, he makes me very comfortable. He's really sexy. And really nice. Well, no, sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's difficult, you know, like every, every job. What it really, for me, is the pleasure to do what I like to do. I think that's a major luxury that I can enjoy when I, while I'm working. Beautiful. Yeah, we're gonna make a picture with a shark. Look. Don't worry. Pretty soon it's gonna go on. Fishing! <laughs> with the help of Ralph, I learned how to fish in the sea. You know, at the end, we even catch a big shark. This time! I thought it's yeah. It's like rough, you know, it's like hard. It's not so nice. First, you put it on the floor, was fine, and then you start to move. <laughs> I was like, ah! Freaking out, I run. Him, John? This size. I won't swim in this water. No way. <laughs> Isabelle is one of my best friends. It's great Diane, you know, brought us together to work together. We're gonna have so much fun. Okay. Nicely. Normal, like a friend. <laughs> <laughs> We're friends, like for real. You see that? It's terrible. I'm blind now. Can't see anything. Come on, girl, damn it. We did double all the time, me and her, you know, sex pictures laying down, relaxing. Yeah, lovely, 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 lovely. Beautiful. There. Very good, thank you. New polo, okay. Very beautiful, yes. Ah, uh, nice. Very good. Beautiful, great. You got it. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
I didn't see her for a month. And it was only one day and a half, but it was great. Very good. Me and my best friend, so. That's right. In parts of Africa, man and nature live side by side in much the same way they did centuries ago. As magical as that sounds, we thought we'd shake things up a bit. So we sent a pair of brand new SI swimsuit models on a safari in Kenya. Africa's been a surprise. It's such a richness between the colors of the jungle and the animals and the Maasai and the camp. There's an intensity, a richness. It's really amazing. Even though I got the cover last year, I was still surprised to be asked back and honored to be picked to come to Africa. Relax your mouth a little bit. There you go. Beautiful. Great. Turn your face, your shoulders a tiny bit this way again. Kenya in the middle of the Maasai Mara. And that was another magical spot. On this trip, we got May Anderson and Reka. Truly beautiful. Reka. She's a new girl who uh, is kind of undiscovered from Europe. I'm from Hungary. <laughs> a very beautiful girl. Like that target? The regular look right there. In the face a little bit like this. Yeah. more, more. And unzip it more. Up or down? Down. Down. Always down. <laughs> you like it if she was a little bit like wet? I love Africa. <laughs> Do you enjoy adventure? I very enjoy. <laughs> Crocodile? I hope so. <laughs> I am very enjoying it. <laughs> May Anderson came in, so it was a breath of fresh air. Hello, darling. She's got a great personality. I'm a bushwoman. <laughs> She's comfortable with herself. I'm in control. <laughs> I'm focused. So it makes you try a little harder. Take it past here. Okay, now lay down on your elbows right there, but keep your butt up in the air. Can you slide that leg back a little bit? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's great. Beautiful, May. Yeah, like that. Oh my God, May, that's it. I worked with a lot of pigs before, but never a warthog. Is this your first time working with warthogs? Yeah, first time. <laughs> Can you get closer to it a little bit? You can't get close to them anyway. They've got huge tusks. And they could bite you. They could cut off your leg. It's scary. Beautiful little creatures. We're trying to lead a pack over to our model. We're going to try and not get gored and get a gorgeous picture before all this scary food runs out. It doesn't really make me nervous because I know everybody's a professional, the pigs, the girl. OK, May, oh, just a little bit farther back. Yep. Uh, Nobody panic. Uh-oh. <laughs> Grab some lard. <laughs> OK, and now if the guy moves away at the same right. Everything was going well until one of them took a little lunge. <laughs> and scared the model. The pig almost ate me. And so I got scared. She did a great job, you know, and came away unscathed. The surprising thing about Africa is you can't really get it in the pictures. It's so vast, so big. But the reflections here are so intense, too. It, things become more intense. Better to be here than to take pictures of it, Amor. Beautiful. Cool. <laughs> Beautiful. Wow, that's great. 
Hey, do you mind standing there where Brian is? Here we go. Maybe more just you're lifting your elbows forward more. There you go. Hey, there, yeah, yeah, yeah. As soon as I meet a girl, I try to figure out, you know, what's the best thing for her, how to make her feel comfortable. Elbow up. There you go. So you have to find the best way to move their body, their face, their hair, everything. You can change. You can make anybody look great within a, a frame. Okay, this is what it looks like from my point of view. Gorgeous, right there. So we went to this village today and the people were very cooperative. It's interesting too because when you come to these <laughs> very diverse cultures, they're so receptive. Okay, Rika, turn your body this way more. Okay, relax your shoulders. Actually, it's heavy. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. You will I have to we'll keep all this and then... Sure. The women were going to do a picture with Mae Anderson. The only thing that's kind of weird here is that I'm all naked and all these people are all covered. Like, normally I wouldn't even care. I know, I'm coming. I'm used no, to it. Like, over yeah. here, I feel kind of huh? subconscious, you know? It's weird. I'm sure there's very, very few people that actually suddenly put together a fashion shoot and direct these gorgeous women to pose. I'm sure they have rarely seen people in swimsuits. Being used to working with models, I had to have them do things over and over. Let's just start walking back over here again. We try to communicate in whatever way we can communicate. Luckily, I think by, um, by just like body language and stuff, they're figuring everything out pretty fast. Somehow it works, and everybody seems to be having a nice time. <laughs> right? You're having a nice time. <laughs> they probably just, like, think it's like, very crazy. <laughs> After the picture, I took Polaroids of all their faces, and they were very excited. And when they'd see a Polaroid, they would all point at each other. Cool, huh? That's me, that's you, that's me, you know? And it's exciting. All this magic that happens. It's just always a surprise, but it's like here. I mean, wow, pretty amazing. Let's catch up with Molly Sims. and I lost him. Fudge! Remember, remember when the fish eats? Yes. He's gonna take off really hard. I think he took my line. Oh, he did. <laughs> he took everything. Oh, there he went, right there. I want a fish, but it's pressure. The life of a supermodel can be fast and furious, but could she make it in the pedal to the metal world of NASCAR? Well, our own Marissa Miller was willing to heat up the track with racing heartthrob Dale Earnhardt Jr. Gentlemen and lady, start your engines. I did a shoot in Daytona on a racetrack, and that was pretty incredible. It's weird, because like my sport I do is like surfing, and that's like chill, mellow. I mean, sometimes it can be exciting, but this is like a whole other world. Great person. Well, I'm probably now the envy of every guy that's ever put on a driving suit. When you see the bump, you know, just one look at her. She's a great person, a lot of fun to be around. It's, it's exciting you, it, being in the car. You can feel the energy. Dale Earnhardt Jr. took me in a race car. Seriously. Get car. He was driving, I was in the passenger seat, scared out of my mind. It's a lot of fun for us drivers to take people around the racetrack who don't know much about the sport or haven't really followed it. I think we were going like 150. It was like being in like a fighter jet or something. It was not a car. Going around the turns, I had no idea how vertical it was. and. The G-forces, and it, it was just incredible. She's got a new appreciation for what we do. Yeah. 
The island of Grenada is a triple threat. It has beaches, mountains, and one of the loveliest cities in the Caribbean. Well, SI brought a trio of its own to rival the island's splendor. South American beauties Fernanda, Michelle, and Yamila. Grenada was this beautiful, colorful lodge called La Luna. We are in La Luna, Grenada. Grenada, no? Grenada. <laughs> we brought last year's cover girl, Yamila, who is so gorgeous. Michelle Alves. We brought back Fernanda Tavares, who a couple of years ago we had an issue. And Enrique taking gorgeous pictures. It was like a big party. We had a wonderful time. <laughs> Ready for a two-hour boat ride to some beach. This beach better be damn good looking. Hopefully, Michelle's gonna shoot first because then we're gonna take some sun. <laughs> so, Ricky saw this little island here and it was like some white beach, and so I was gonna stop there. <laughs> we went to this island. And we shot like the whole day there and beautiful, it was hot. I got burned, <laughs> I got some burn. Beautiful. One, two, three. Yeah. Beautiful. So we're just all getting wet and taking sun and you know like screaming and laughing. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> it was like a lot of fun. Beautiful. I just like pin the tail on the model. It's nice because you don't feel like you're working. And you know, Ricky's always like this, you know, I think that's what my friend says. That he comes, he works, but at the same time he has fun. And I think that's very important in life. Fantastic, Bravo. First time in Grenada. Yeah, it's beautiful. Very, very nice. I'm happy to be here with sports illustrated. They decide in the light. So, in the light. Beautiful layer, then. Fantastic, yes. Yeah, beautiful layer, fantastic. Beautiful. One more, and I got it. What's next? They have to get a beautiful setting, the light, but more that she looks amazing, and then we work around her, actually. And at the end of the day, it's about them, you know? And then, then the setting works with her. Super precious, incredible. If I get the cover this year, well, I'm gonna be very happy, though, because, you know, they always choose the best covers. So if I get the cover, I'm sure it's going to be a beautiful picture. I think a baby suit that makes your woman's body look good is a good one. They're very nice. <laughs> I think they make my body look good. <laughs> so I think it helps a lot when you're comfortable, you know, what you're wearing and you like it and you feel pretty and then the picture is going to be, like, beautiful. locations a lot, in beautiful locations. I do a lot of summer clothes and bathing suits, so I'm going always with, to nice places, like this one. And it's just been an amazing experience. Unique, gorgeous, amazing for pictures, and amazing place to stay.
Nobody knows better than I the power of the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Issue. I made my first appearance when I was just 18, not that long ago, actually. And it changed my life, and I'm not the only one. Great, Patrick. That's beautiful. Don't move anything except your eyes. Water! Water! Shooting for SI is like, it's the biggest of the biggest. The American flag, apple pie, and swimsuit issue, I mean, it's gotten to that point. It's amazing. The attention. Thank you, fans. The publicity. Well, last time I shot for Sports Illustrated, I was casting my first feature film. The anticipation. The guys just wait for the issue to come out. It's just a phenomenon. It's amazing that it's become that. People always talk about the Sports Illustrated issue. Everybody's asking, where are you going? Are you doing it? Does everybody and their mother want to do it? Absolutely. I've become the most popular girl in town right before we start <laughs> casting for the issue because it does change their lives. Things just roll. You get fan mail and it's weird. Once you do it, you know, I think people trust you more and respect you more. And Molly Sims has become a household word because of the issue. It helped me so much. When 52 million people are putting a face with a name, you get that, you know, acknowledgement. And of course, the photographers, this is a, a plum job for them. The Sports Illustrated is one of the reasons I wanted to become a photographer. After last year's cover, my life changed tenfold. Diane Smith, the editor, is incredible. She really tries to get something out of each of us that's really says something about us. The big problem is there are so many beautiful, beautiful girls out there. So I can't book them all. You realize our relationship will change if we get the cover together, right? You're a liar if you say you don't want the cover. My first time out with Sports Illustrated was the cover with Elsa. Well, I'm hoping for that cover now, baby. Cover, cover, cover. If I try to don't have expectations, I hope and I try my best, and if it happens, it's going to be great. Well, how much can we love a Gautier on the cover, Jenny? Yeah. When you think about one out of every four people in the United States read it, it's just larger than life. You just go about and just do what you can do to make the best team, the best place, the best pictures, and that's your focus. I look forward to it, not just because it's a great job, but it's the people. She's always picking on me. She's always touching me, my hair, everything. It's a team effort. You really just want to do beautiful pictures. Like, that's the main thing. Every year, we do try to come up with a new surprise. So next year, the 40th, I am sure we will come up with something even better. Barbados is like a James Bond movie. It's colorful and adventurous by day, and there's plenty of action at night. But where would a Bond movie be without the Bond girls? Life is beautiful. <laughs> really beautiful out here. Here we are in gorgeous, beyond gorgeous Barbados. Amazing spot. We have Daniela Pastova. <laughs> Juliana Martins is a new model that's here in Barbados. And Melissa Keller, who this is her second year. Bond models. I would love to do like a Wonder Woman suit. I think that would be really, really cool. Superhero, yeah. <laughs> it's very James Bond, so it's really, it's fun. I love this suit so much. It's very sexy and like action kind of stuff. Foxy color. It's back. This is my second year doing Sports Illustrated. I'm a little more comfortable now. It's really great here. I really like it. <laughs> I'm really, you know, I'm definitely more myself, and it's, it's nice. I love it. So if I'm, like, really fast, can you chase me around, do you think? We'll have to see. <laughs> <laughs> Who's our photographer? Bond. Gavin Bond. Right there, that's great. Next out there. British boy. Beautiful, hold it up like that. Gorgeous, gorgeous. 
How's your photographer? Everybody wants to know. Everybody's asking. How's Gavin? I can't tell you that. I'd have to kill you. Watch this. There, 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 there. Kevin? Take two. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Brilliant. It's a secret. Where are we? Barbados. Barbados? Barbados. You did all the styling on the animals. The whole idea is for the octopus to be wearing a hat. It gives a character. Well, that's just really plain. I like the symbol of the animals. Juliana Martins is a beautiful new girl. I try to mix veteran models, models have been in the past with new models, because you need that, that surprise and you need, you need both in the issue. Beautiful, just like that, gorgeous. Daniela Pestova was here in Barbados and she left before I got here and I was really bummed because she's one of the models that I would just love to meet because she's an inspiration. Uh, perfect. Eyes now, to me. Take your hands in just slightly. <laughs> She's beautiful, and she's been doing Sports Illustrated for a while now, I believe. It's January of the Golden Year calendar. Okay, that needs back to spike there. Is it there? Perfect. You want to reflect on it? Love that one. Can you be my caddy? Turn, try and turn to me just a little bit there. You get it. Go on, ready? The hand on the strap just flatten it out. It's a bit too. That's fine. That's nice. And that, that just would have been really neat to me. That was great, Daniela. Oh, thank you. I enjoyed that. <laughs> We did shoot into the late hours at the local nightclub. Oh, this is so funny. <laughs> and we had Juliana Martins, who just arrived from Paris three hours before, dancing till three o'clock in the morning. Oh, it was amazing. Come over here, gorgeous. Just like a lean from here. Shooting on the bar. There, 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 there. Beautiful. Everybody was great. Everybody had a great time. I loved this. <laughs> I love adventure. Uh, the Wave Runner. Right. Where are the keys? Give me the keys. Give me the keys. <laughs> we did a shot with a jet ski. I'm like, love sports, so it was awesome to do that. Okay, ready? I go parasailing. I have never parasailed before, and I'm a little freaked out. Yeah, we're having a fun time. Bond models. He's one of the world's best sports photographers, and she's the top-ranked women's tennis star. But this time, it's a whole new racket for Serena Williams, seen through the lens of SI's photographer, Walty Yos. I think Serena's beauty is this combination of, of looks and, and brawn almost. Perfect woman athlete. She's strong, she's fast, she's quick. 
believe it or not, I've always wanted to do the swimsuit issue. I love swimsuits. She's got that great smile, you know, it's gonna be a good day. Well, turn your body a little, so yeah. I'm very, very, very comfortable in front of the camera. That's why I like to do a lot of acting and modeling. It comes natural for me. It's not really hard for me to pose. I just try to take a different role and just pretend I'm in my own world. The thing I really enjoy is taking a great athlete, especially the peak of their career. There's been sex appeal in athletes since the first athlete. Keep going, four more steps. It's like a heartbeat. I, uh, this is horrible. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. No. I don't know why I'm so scared I can swim, but I, I just got it's hair. hair. It's the hair, I don't want to get my hair away. You know how we are about getting my hair away. I think the best pictures of any athlete in the early days of their career, because as you look back in 10 years, there's that youthful exuberance. Throw those arms out when you get up. Yeah. Hair Williams! <laughs> that's a hot shot. I haven't told anybody I'm going to be in it. Maybe one of my friends, that's it, or two of my friends. I'm definitely going to run out. I mean, the moment it comes, I'm not going to wait. I'm just going to run out and get a copy. And I'm not going to tell anybody. I'm just gonna, going to wait until my phone rings. Let's see how Molly's doing. Oh my god, I got one. I got one. I caught three. Two tiny ones and one decent one. I'm a fly fisher woman officially now. Well, it looks like we've saved the best for last. For sheer exotic beauty, nothing can match the wonder of Turkey, except perhaps a bevy of beauties, all decked out in blonde and blue. Surprise. I don't think anybody really knew what to expect from Turkey, including myself. Diane came up with this great idea for this shoot that we would do blonde girls in blue bikinis, or blue swimsuits. And that's great for me because it really gives me a theme to play off of, and it gives a continuity to the story. I shot with Sarah O'Hare, the Australian model, who's fantastic. She has that energy that's particular to Australian. She's full of life and fun. This is the look for today. <laughs> We're going blue. Bridget Hall is a special favorite. I've worked with her for many years since she was 16 years old. I feel like she's like my daughter or something. Hey, Bridget. Ready to do another picture? Marissa Miller is fantastic. She's an all-American. She's just a bombshell, and she really is the real deal. Turkey's one of the places I've always wanted to come to, and so I'm really excited to be here. It's beautiful shot on a boat yesterday. I think they call them a gullet. Traditional Turkish boat and we went and um, sailed out to find turquoise water and we found it everywhere. Oh. Wow, wow, wow. There you are kind of your own little group in your own little world and the background is simple. Gorgeous. Great, 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 great. Nice. Great, great, Sarah. We're gonna need a longer lens. We shot on this um, wooden speedboat, which is really cool. It's just great being out on a boat shooting. The light's always pretty. And the wind, you know, it's like magic being on a boat. I love shooting on a boat. We were on a boat, great time. Perfect weather. I jumped off the boat. Go! <laughs> nice! Twice. Wow. Congrats. Diane had talked about the ruins, and I thought, oh, ruins, you know, and I'd seen one or two pictures, but didn't quite understand the scope and the drama of the ruins that are here. I think it's what's incredible. It's why I always wanted to come to Turkey. It's just the unbelievable history of the place. Amazing. Stuart's fantastic. 
It really allows you to be free and, and but also to shoot you quite strong. We were taking the Grecian goddess shots, I think. Yeah, and it's not even Australian Greek goddess. <laughs> <laughs> the Temple of Zeus is incredible. To see the columns and, and the ruins. Finished. I think it's beautiful. We got it. It's great. <laughs> we have this inside joke. Is it BC or AD? Because it's old and it's really old here. We were in the city Ephesus that it was an ancient village. Ephesus was amazing. It was really cool. Lots of pillars, rows of columns all down the road, marble roads, amazing. The worst has happened. We got here and there were millions of tour buses. And it was like I suspected, like Mount Rushmore is for us, just people streaming in constantly. Now remember who you're with. Why Hold your money. Mm -hmm. I've never seen anything like it in my life. Can, can any of the guys help us just with the people, just to keep it moving? This is when the going gets tough. I'm going to go help Bridget change. Does it work? It's kind of uncomfortable being the only one in a bathing suit in front of all these people, but it's a job. Someone's got to do it. Well, at least I know I'll be in a lot of people's homes. And they'll be showing me to friends and family. When you're trying to shoot bikinis, somehow a portly man in dark knee socks and dark shoes doesn't kind of take you there. Sure enough, driving along, I remembered a lake we passed on the way out. And as we were pulling up, the light was gorgeous. I said, stop the buses. We have five minutes for hair and makeup. Get out of here. Let's hustle up there, people. We jumped out and did two incredible pictures on Bridget. You got to keep your mind open when you're on the road. And when you see a 25-mile lake, you got to stop and check it out. We got the last light and beautiful pictures. I know this the Marissa Miller is fantastic. She's from California. She's over the top beautiful. This is my favorite thing to do because it's so relaxed and I grew up on the beach, so being in a bikini on the beach is very familiar to me, so it's very comfortable. Do I get a belly rub? I love to surf, so whenever I go to the beach, if I can get in the water, that's the first thing I'll do. You try to have fun with it, and you try to let yourself go. I'm great. And that's why we now say it's Miller time. Woo! Sarah, Bridget, and Marissa all have different energy. So I know them well enough to know how to bring out that little special something in each of them to make the pictures spark and really see them. This is With each girl, I do something different. That's my job, to build them up and make them feel so great about themselves that it shows in the pictures. Nice! That's my favorite. Great! That's all for the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Special. 2003, eight stellar locations, 17 beautiful models, dozens of swimsuits, and miles of film. Those are the stats, sports fans. Now here comes the instant replay. From the Hotel Del Coronado, where we still like it hot, I'm Rachel Hunter. See you later.